Did you know that each time your Dupixent Dupilumab is shipped to you, you're getting more than just your medicine in that delivery box? It's true. Dupixent is a prescription medicine used as an add-on maintenance treatment for people 12 and up who have moderate to severe eosinophilic or oral steroid-dependent asthma that is not controlled with their current asthma medicines. Dupixent is not used to treat sudden breathing problems. With each delivery of Dupixent, you're also getting an opportunity for better control of your asthma. Just imagine what that improvement could mean for you. Each time you open that box, think about how Dupixent may help you do more of what you want in life. What could you do with more freedom from asthma? What could you spend more of your time doing? And remember, if you take your Dupixent every other week as prescribed, you're not only working to help prevent attacks, you're also giving yourself the opportunity to do more with less asthma. And don't forget, Dupixent My Way is always just a phone call away with a nurse educator available 24-7. Indication. Dupixent is a prescription medicine used with other asthma medicines for the maintenance treatment of moderate to severe eosinophilic or oral steroid-dependent asthma in people aged 12 years and older whose asthma is not controlled with their current asthma medicines. Dupixent helps prevent severe asthma attacks, exacerbations, and can improve your breathing. Dupixent may also help reduce the amount of oral corticosteroids you need while preventing severe asthma attacks and improving your breathing. Dupixent is not used to treat sudden breathing problems. It is not known if Dupixent is safe and effective in children with asthma under 12 years of age. Important safety information. Do not use if you are allergic to Dupilumab or to any of the ingredients in Dupixent. Before using Dupixent, tell your healthcare provider about all your medical conditions including if you have a parasitic helminth infection, are taking oral, topical, or inhaled corticosteroid medicines, do not stop taking your corticosteroid medicines unless instructed by your healthcare provider. This may cause other symptoms that were controlled by the corticosteroid medicine to come back. Are scheduled to receive any vaccinations. You should not receive a live vaccine if you are treated with Dupixent are pregnant or plan to become pregnant, it is not known whether Dupixent will harm your unborn baby. Are breastfeeding or plan to breastfeed, it is not known whether Dupixent passes into your breast milk. Tell your healthcare provider about all the medicines you take, including prescription and over-the-counter medicines, vitamins and herbal supplements. If you are taking asthma medicines, do not change or stop your asthma medicine without talking to your healthcare provider. Dupixent can cause serious side effects, including allergic reactions, hypersensitivity, including a severe reaction known as anaphylaxis. Stop using Dupixent and tell your healthcare provider or get emergency help right away if you get any of the following symptoms. Breathing problems, fever, general ill feeling, swollen lymph nodes, swelling of the face, mouth, and tongue, hives, itching, fainting, dizziness, feeling lightheaded, low blood pressure, joint pain, or skin rash. Inflammation of your blood vessels. Rarely this can happen in people with asthma who receive Dupixent. This may happen in people who also take a steroid medicine by mouth that is being stopped or the dose is being lowered. It is not known whether this is caused by Dupixent. Tell your healthcare provider right away if you have rash, shortness of breath, persistent fever, chest pain, or a feeling of pins and needles or numbness of your arms or legs. The most common side effects in patients with asthma include injection site reactions, pain in the throat, oropharyngeal pain, and high count of a certain white blood cell, eosinophilia. Tell your healthcare provider if you have any side effect that bothers you or that does not go away. These are not all the possible side effects of Dupixent. Call your doctor for medical advice about side effects. You are encouraged to report negative side effects of prescription drugs to the FDA. Visit www.fda.gov slash medwatch or call 1-800-FDA-1088.
Use Dupixent exactly as prescribed. Dupixent is an injection given under the skin, subcutaneous injection. If your healthcare provider decides that you or a caregiver can give Dupixent injections, you or your caregiver should receive training on the right way to prepare and inject Dupixent. Do not try to inject Dupixent until you have been shown the right way by your healthcare provider. In children 12 years of age and older, it is recommended that Dupixent be administered by or under supervision of an adult. Please see full prescribing information, including patient information, at dupixent.com.